Okay, everybody, we're back. Um, our bull baiter bear, Finn, our performer, and myself, our narrator. Um, we're going to do ping pong. Ping pong is a strategic and structured game. This is taught always in calmness because that's the strategic part about it. You're teaching the dog to be calm when they're possibly in the moment, in the environment. Calmness might not be their first reaction. So this game is structured because you stand in the center. You have a strategic or a structured spot. You're here and you're going to be putting treats out on either side of you. The dog is going to be coming back to center, giving you their start button, looking up at you, and then you'll put a treat down over here. Dog will go over, eat the treat, will come back to center. You'll mark that and you'll go over there and put the treat. Dog eats the treat, comes back to center. You mark that and you push the targets or roll the tree further and further out. Remember that roll needs to be controlled. Let's not roll it under something so the dog can't find it because we're not playing search. So this game is brings motion. Uh, a lot of dogs can stay calmer if they're in motion than if they're stationary. So we definitely, we, we bring them into thinking. They can observe the environment, allow them to keep the pace going at their pace, not at yours, at their pace. I always start this game with up, down. I'm using targets. So I won't be as close into my foot. <clears throat> and Finn's pretty adept. Yes! That's sitting on the target. here a little bit. I'm going back to center. I want, yes, Finn to come back to center. I'm going to put that down there. I want Finn to come back to center. Yes! This way I know, this is going to go down here. This way I know the dog understands the game. Now I got confused there. Yes! He went boom, boom. That's okay because he came back to center and looked up at me. And we restarted the pattern. Yes! Gotta come to center. Yes! All right. Yes! And we can move this a little further out. Yes! And move this one a little further out. Yes! And a cookie scatter over here. And now I'm going to add just um, <clears throat> a dog with a snuffle mat. There you go. And um, the thing about Finn is you could bring an 800-pound gorilla in here. And if I was giving him treats, he'd be happy. So here we go. Up, down to start. You're stationary. You're stationary in the center. That's your place. Dog looks up. Yes! We move over here. Yes! Yes! What a good boy! This game can be used. Yes! 
can be used to um, diffuse a bad habit. So say you leave, yes, your <clears throat> front door open, there's a glass there, so that there's a screen, yes, so the dog can see out. You can start, yes, doing, or charges the door. You can start doing ping pong and teach, and you bring calmness, yes, into what's going on and you can diffuse how they feel about that door. Yes, how they feel about, yes, about the person walking by because you're gonna be doing ping pong and they're gonna feel better about ping pong than they do about the stranger walking by. You are a good boy. Cookie scatter, thank you for watching. Oh, I'm over here. Okay.